welcome welcome to target lock tv this is the finals this is also the seventh game played today and with me i have philip jordovich is it yep. correct yep with us correct. <laughs> uh, and i'm just gonna reset the time we got uh pavel kak from uh poland and uh, and we also have Rickard Andersson, a local player here, and from Target Lock Gothenburg. And we had uh, the players roll for first player, and Rickard got it this time. So we'll see how important this will be for the game. Let's see. I'm just going to go over and adjust the table slightly. I'll be right back, Philip. Uh, Hate to put you on the spot, but it's not a problem. Do you want me to break down the list? Uh, probably his Simon is already left. So, uh, yeah, we have an interesting matchup. So basically, uh, if you were with us with uh, with the last game, um, where Rickard won uh, against a three resistance X wing list. Um, he then had uh, the second player, he was second player, and uh, he was facing, um, again, a Poe Dameron, but uh, that was the Trigger Happy Flyboy Poe Dameron. This one is the Heralds of Hope, as they call him, Bad Poe. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, um, this this tournament is ba was basically, when you look at the faction representation, it was the uh, Resistance and Re Rebels galore. Um, and uh, this final is another uh, another way to show it. Uh, and also, we have a Polish versus Swedish, uh, Poland versus Sweden uh, matchup. And we have a quite similar lists, so to speak, because we have a big ship, uh, a large base ship, um, and we have two small base ships, uh, with one uh, being the uh, a sort of a support one, and one of them being the uh, more aggressive, uh, um, the, the ship that goes for damage. Um, and it's quite, and we have a couple of, well, basically, I think we have all of the, all of the, um, all of the famous ships, shall we say. Yeah. Uh, we have the Millennium Falcon, we have the Outrider or the YT-2400 Freighter, uh, we have the X-Wings, the A-Wings, the Y-Wings, whichever one you like, if you if you are the light side supporter, that is. Um, I, I didn't go over the lists, uh, like, in detail, so if you yeah. want to do that. Uh, yeah, let, let's put them on... Uh... Um, they are viewing. Let's see. we can start with Pavel's list. Uh, let's see, we got Sorry, yep. uh, which says after a ship of range one performs an action during the perform action step, if that action is on your action bar, you may spend one charge to perform that action, treating it as red. This is paired with wartime loadout, uh, which gives uh, uh, two extra shields. And replaces the um, the intuitive interface yes. with the uh, however is it called? Let me just pull it up. Uh, it's devastating barrage. Basically, it gives her the auto blasters ability if she if she fires a torpedo or a missile attack, mm -hmm. um, and um, it doesn't have to be uh outmaneuvered uh to no. to have your crits not being cancelled so that can be really good especially now that you have a nine ho nine nine health y wing um that can do a target lock uh or a, a turret rotate and um that's going to be interesting, to say the least. And <laughs> she's also a support ship, and that uh, with that ability. Um, and that R4 opens up the dial uh, a lot more. So those protons are going to be hard to 
Well, basically with protons you get two crits, right? Yeah. If uh, um... or, or at, at least at least uh, at least one crit. So if you're firing a proton torpedo, you you you're guaranteed to do one damage anyway. If if the defender is in your bullseye arc. Yeah, yeah that's true. But yeah. Yeah, I think I think you can manage that with with uh, Pavel yeah. being second player, yes. uh, and all of his ships are moving after uh, Rickard's ships, so that can be beneficial. Um, we also so got yeah. the soft ray, uh, only <laughs> upgraded with uh, Chewbacca, uh, which uh, starts off with two charges. Oh, it actually uh, it starts off with one charge. And after a friendly ship at zero to three uh, is dealt a damage card, it will recover the second charge. So uh, while he uh, raid and performs an attack, uh, you may spend two charges from Shabaka to change one uh, eye result to a crit result. And with raid's ability, you can. Uh, get some extra <laughs> extra it's an yeah. yeah we also have basically basically if you blank out it's not a problem no <laughs> and we also got uh, uh let's see is it bad bonus resistance yeah, commander this, we, we call we call it it's called a bad po i don't know why but he, he's a bad po <laughs> there we go we can spend two charges uh uh, who can spend charges to perform a uh, white action as a red with heroic or for astromech and advanced proton torpedoes and let's see we just saw uh, Rickard's uh, list being played but let's put it up here we got the uh, dash render with trickshot perceptive co-pilot outrider engine air so which gives him focus and Uh, usually provided by Jake Farrell with marksmanship and we also have a uh, Luke Skywalker with advanced proton torpedoes and as well yeah so basically we have a uh, as I said a big base ship um, that can do basically anything he wants or he or she wants mm -hmm. uh, we have a small base ship that is acting as a support and we have a small base ship with advanced proton torpedoes so that, that that's kind of, that's kind of how both of the lists are working right now. Yes. So yeah, uh, Zori was Zori is a new uh, pilot um, that came out recently mm -hmm. with the new points update as well uh, with the, with these resistance Y wings. So she immediately uh, was uh, regarded as um, the the pilot to go for when taking a resistance y-wing especially when she can be decked out like this uh with a dorsal turret and basically then you have um two arcs to shoot from and uh, the dorsal turret can be quite effective if you want to let let's say if you want to um cover a specific part of the board for whatever reason, uh, if you want to control it, uh, and maybe don't want uh, want your enemy to, if he goes on the flank, you're more or less safe. And we see Ray just going straight. She is um, going down the board and probably um, will bank uh, at some point and uh, get into. Yet there's two to attempt yeah. to probably go uh, and uh, go after Luke. We see that Jake is uh, isolated, so to say, in the corner. Um, he's probably doing a one hard, uh, uh, two hard next turn. Um, and Dash is probably doing a bank maneuver so that he can uh, probably remain uh, with those turrets pointing at the at the enemy ships. Um, and the bad bow is uh, uh, right down uh, next to Luke, so um, so that would be a target lock, I would say. Yes. 
Yeah, he spends the two charges here to uh, to use his pilot ability to take a target lock. Yeah, and he took a stress because that action has to be read. Um, okay, so that's a range one shot, I believe. Advanced and that's protons advanced protons. Okay, so five this dice. Is... <laughs> <laughs> Coming into Luke Skywalker. Oh, out of the box. Right. But this is two hits and two crits. Oh. Spence. You, target imagine him. if this was Zori Bliss firing. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and you are taking two crits. What? And that's a third oh. crit. Oh. And it gets one oh. hit converted. Oh. Uh, so. Uh, Luke spends damaged what? engine. Okay, that's the first crit. So, yeah, he took two shields and took one crit. Okay, so he that spent... was that was not a good start at all. What was that? Was that damaged engine? Yep. Yeah. So for Luke, it would be much harder to uh, do. Uh, the hard turn maneuvers. Um, okay, so Luke uh, re uh, has this his. Is, I think this his is dash. Rolling out of the box. So okay, this might be actual dash. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, three hits. Taking two. There. The venue is uh, dead silence, silent now, so the players can hear everything I say. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so so uh, we, we shouldn't talk about uh, where they should go. <laughs> I, I, I should... will just I will just hum and and. <laughs> <laughs> uh, which which tune from Star Wars should be hum? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. Well, it's it's, it's sure. never a good thing to take a, a, a advanced proton uh, torpedo like that. But then, now, now that torpedo is gone, and yeah, well, uh, I think uh, if you wanted to do advanced protons on a ship, yeah, um, Luke was probably the way to do it. Yeah, uh, because. Um, he's probably the one that's hardest to kill yep. um, in this list, uh, in Rickard's list. So I think your overlay is active from last game, so the dash is only for Hull and Jake. Oh, yeah. Is two and two. <laughs> so I'm like, uh, for some reason, I looked at the points, I was like, 100 to 1? Uh, no. <laughs> of course. That's not it. <laughs> there we go. And dash is, let gonna... me help you, six and four. There yep. we go, I will just correct. And look is at uh, three hull left. There we go. Jake. Boosting, giving tokens. Yep. Okay, so we have a four straight from Luke. So he's going after Zori. Uh, probably target locking so that he may use his advanced proton torpedoes this turn. Yeah. Boosting. Okay, so did he not uh, take a target lock? No. Okay, so maybe this was an attempt to block. Yeah, and My uh, wing. get around behind next turn, maybe. I don't know. We'll see. Probably, yeah. And dash is um, 
turning around to probably uh, be ready if Po um, does a hard turn to uh, take that sh that deck side arc uh, side turret shot. So let's see if this fits. Wiggle room, yes, indeed. Okay, wiggle room, um, and Zori will have. Clusters are not working at range one, I believe. Um, let me double check that. Clusters, they are, but um, there probably wouldn't be another target to shoot at, so it's probably going to be a, a regular uh, primary attack uh, for Zori at Luke. We see Ray moving in to bank. Okay, so we have, yeah, um, well, as we kind of expected, Ray is turning in. Um, Um, okay, so Poe, um, again, as expected, uh, too hard to the left, uh, keeps, probably keeps the arc pointed at Luke. Um, I guess he will uh, boost, yeah? Mm. Gunning for Luke. So we got shots here. Po into Luke. Hit and okay. Crit. So hit and a crit coming in to Luke for Luke. Uh, he will have his force ready. So yeah, it takes one. That's crit. gonna be, I think, one crit. Yeah, and that's not a good, a good thing. If you are the, and we didn't see that what the crit was. Uh, it has it's... a fairly. It has a fairly long text. Yeah, um, it's something with pilots. <laughs> yeah, might be blinded. Or it's fixable, I think, because it has an action to yeah. fix it, so. Uh, or maybe... I will sort it pilot? out. It? Could be. This was... Uh, yeah. Evaded. <laughs> so, uh, dash onto Po. This will be a Probably the most important shot in this yes. engagement for the for, for the, the rebel hook. player. Oh, so hit and a crit. Yeah, that that's that's um, that would, that might be easy for Poe to evade. Might be. Didn't say has to be. <laughs> Takes uh, uh, one shield. And I think one crit. Is it going to uh, only one, one, yeah. one shield? Yeah. He's shuffling uh, so, his uh, damage deck here. Okay, so. Paul might just be off the hook here because uh, he oh he takes a crit so that's a loose stabilizer oh that's two crits. and and a fuel leak so yeah um you need only one crit more to kill that Paul with Emeron. so um yeah and Chewbacca is now active as they said. Because Bo took the took the damage. Yes. Um, so Ray will now do what Ray does best. And as I said that, <laughs> Two oh, eights. that is nice. Takes one crit. Loose uh, stabilizer. Loose stabilizer. Okay, so he has to go straight. Yes. Uh, he cannot turn. He has to go straight. And he has something pilot on him. <laughs> <laughs> so that look is very predictable right now. Because he doesn't want to die. He has to go straight. 
Let's hit it crit from... Uh, sorry. And I think that's a dead look. Yeah. Oh, that's... Or, uh, or was that dash? Uh, that was a dash. That was dash. Okay, so... Um, so it takes one shield, I think. Oh, was that the... Did she... Okay, so that was only a... That was maybe... A... Was that a... Um... Sorry, I'm blanking out. Was that a... Uh, I'm just gonna Research? pause the guys. Uh, yeah. Can you flip down the turning a little bit? Let's see. Let me see. Where am I? Jake. Yeah. That's Jake uh, shooting on Ray. Okay. So we have. Um, okay, Ray will spend her for her force and take only one, one damage, I believe. So yes. yeah. And she's enjoying life right now because. She's basically flanking um, Luke and Dash <laughs> for give or take. Uh, mm. And Luke, Luke is basically right now uh, with um, with two possibilities. I think he's stressed. Uh, he has a he has a uh, he has to go straight, and yeah. he cannot turn because all of his Hard maneuvers are now red. So yeah, the only, I mean, the only, the only possible solutions for him are one or two straight. Yeah. And so, uh, we got Andreas Carlson pointing out that it was a wounded pilot the first. Uh, okay, uh, so actions are not possible as well. Yeah. <laughs> there okay. we go. That's bad, to say the least. Yes. Um, Well, Luke is basically going one or two straight, so uh, either Ray or Poe will probably gonna kill him uh, this turn. Um, I think there is no way uh, for him to... Well, he can defend and stay alive, but uh, doing any any maneuver other than a straight maneuver will kill him straight away. <laughs> so... Um, yeah, and we had the we have the uh, we have Jake. Well, Jake might be uh, interesting right now because he is sort of also flanking Ray, and having that marksmanship might be important as well. If he can uh, go up behind Ray, um, he can start chipping away those uh, those shields and uh, hull points, uh, and if he can get some crits onto Ray, that could be also really beneficial. And I think Dash should uh, focus on Poe and try to even out the score. Uh, if Luke is going down this turn, then or maybe Jake will go after Poe. And this is also a good thing because Jake just might block Ray this turn yeah. and uh, not let her have any actions. And if... Uh, and if a dash moved fast, uh, he just might arc dodge Ray as well. So, let's see. This was probably a one straight. Yeah. Bump. Probably attempting to maybe benefit from uh, Zori bumping into him and maybe Poe as well. To not take any shots. And clearing that stress. Yep. No actions because wounded pilot. No... Uh, Okay, so Dash is going straight. He basically doesn't care uh, because he needs that range 2 or range 3 attack. So let's see what happens. I I'm interested to see what Ray and Poe did. Uh, Zor is probably bumping, I think, into Luke. Okay, so he decided to move Ray first, probably because she bumped. Or yeah. did she? She does. She might be over. So Ray is clear. And Jake is not happy with this, I think. Or maybe he is. We'll find out. Um.
Let us see what he decides as his action. Is that's a focus, right? Yes. Okay. Um, let's see what Zori did. Well, he's willing to get a template, so yeah, it's a two bank. It it's might it might not be a bump, so let's see. Okay, so Zori is going towards dash. And this might be a target lock and proton torpedoes, bullseye. You love to see it, as they say. Um, crits everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so that's a that's a target lock. Um, and now we have the uh, commander of the resistance, Mr. Paul Dameron. Okay, so that's Zori's ability, I think. Uh, giving herself an action. Yeah. And Poe is probably bumping. Yes. It's going to take a shot from uh, Dash. So Luke is not going to take any shots uh, this turn. Yeah, and that is uh, quite important for him right now because he's not losing points. Um, okay, so let's see uh, if Ricker can uh, strip away the focus. Ooh, only one crit, so that just might be safe from Zori. Yeah, so it waits. She's like... <laughs> I'm not taking your crits. <laughs> um, um, okay, so... Ray? Ray is taking a shot at... Um, Dash? Yeah. That's... Oh, why would you need any modifications? Chewbacca or even... Um, Takes one? Yeah. That's a... That those 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 dice are brutal. Red dice are brutal today <laughs> in these last two games. <laughs> I, I'm not sure how many crits they have. These guys have rolled today. Um, okay, so, so we have advanced. We have proton torpedoes. We have yes. a target lock. We got those a lot two crits. Of crits. <laughs> yeah, those two crits are definitely going through. Let's see if any more will. Oh, 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 and it converts. Crits. Yep. Those all are going through. He doesn't even have to roll his dice. And this is how you play with a uh, wartime loadout, folks. <laughs> that's how you play. Let's see. Do that's one see damage the... engine and something okay. else. Um, uh, after you execute a maneuver, that's a stun oh, pilot. Oh, stun pilot. Oh, um, okay. So he ignores obstacles, but yeah. if he goes over an obstacle, he would still take a damage, I think. Right? Maybe. <laughs> Let's see if it <laughs> gets we'll, relevant. We'll, yeah, we'll, we'll find out. Um, but I think Dash is now in a good position because he can just go uh, go around and probably don't take any damage. So. And that's okay. three hits uh, from Jake into... Ray? Oh. Right. Poe is gone? Oh no, that's Poe! Okay, so... Jake Farrell, the hero of the rebellion. Um, yeah. <laughs> this is this is actually quite important because very important. Uh, Poe is down. Ray and Zori are left. Um, this is Rise of Skywalker all over again. Uh, yeah. <laughs> uh, yeah, and now um, Luke is basically safe. Luke can now just go four or five straight uh repair all of those crits and then he can do whatever he wants or just go go around a different way and uh just stay away from the battle and preserve those 32 points that are left on him um while jake and dash can probably do some damage still um initiatives are overlapping now so no initiative kills can happen Let's see. Um, so, loose stabilizers. 
clears. Yep. Yes, so he can. So I'm sorry, dash looking is, at me. <laughs> yeah. So so dash is safe. Uh, yeah. Dash uh, in, in in a way that uh, even even if Zori or Ray uh, deal him a lot of damage, he can he could still shoot. Even though Rickard is the first player, the initiatives overlapping uh, is a good thing for him now. Um, and now Jake also um, is at a prime spot to maybe do only a, also no because Ray is there. He might be we might be able to do a two straight if he can fit that, uh, and then just wait for Zori to. Um, move and then he probably have a shot at her most definitely um or maybe do a one bank and then barrel roll or whatever um let's see what he decided okay that's a two straight a commentator predicted one thing good so <laughs> <laughs> oh. yeah that that's a good thing um and basically i think here dash just goes for a another bank when okay he's boosting i wasn't expecting that so he's going to give dash his tokens i guess um yeah and dash is like i'm in a defender now that i haven't even moved <laughs> um okay so that's a four straight yeah 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 go away repair those crits and then when the time is right go back so loose yeah, stabilizer is gone. He can now uh, do banks and take and stern talent rolls. But I think you want to repair all the other crits and then do anything. Okay, so right. he will he will land on a, on an obstacle. Yeah, and he will take a damage. Yeah, he should take a damage. Let's see if he remember if they remember. He forgot, right? Okay, so I think there's a there's a rules uh, debate right now. Yes, <laughs> it is, and uh, I am delegating that to. Yeah, I think you should take because it says if you. Yeah, he's taking the damage here. Yeah. So dash is down to three. And this is not what he wanted to do. No. I think I think he basically forgot about that crit. Yes. Okay, so now but that's like how many matches did this did this these two guys play today? This is game seven. Oh, seven games in one day. Yes. <laughs> well, I think my brain would be in the uh, in the uh, water you. state. <laughs> the water <laughs> state. <laughs> my um, brain is cooked. <laughs> liquid, yeah, liquid. Uh, yeah. So forgetting one crit is basically well. You you can you can um you can say that that is uh, exhaustion or whatever. Um, because yeah, seven games in one day that that's a lot. Uh, that's more let's like XTC, uh, is like six or five games in a day, so this is even more than that. <laughs> um, so we have Zori enjoying life again, yeah. she, she's target locking, and that's probably a Cluster missile, uh, she's in bullseye, so wartime loadout will serve her nice there. Um, and let's see if, if did Jade block Ray? Yes. Okay, so that might be beneficial, um, even though Ray doesn't need uh, mods uh, because of the Force and Chewbacca and all of the other stuff. Uh, so she 
she might have a shot, but I'm not sure. Okay, so cluster missiles are coming. Yeah. Uh, dash this way. Oh, okay, one crit definitely goes. That's for sure. Um, do you spend a target lock here? Yes. Okay, so nothing. Um, a hit and the crit. Okay, so you can you evade the hit and you only take one crit. Um, and that is. We don't see it. We don't see it. No, that's a hull bridge. Okay. So every hit is a crit. So Ray now has a good option to um, maybe make Dash take some more crits if she has arc to begin with. I think um, it's out. Yeah, I think so because it's... Jake is the hero of the rebellion again. <laughs> yeah, he's preserving his uh, companions. <laughs> Uh, in uh, keeping them alive. Um, well, now I think Ga Dash does a. Well, what do you do with Dash right now? Because that turret arc is pointed le uh, left to right. You need shots. Uh, because you need to put get some damage on Ray and Zori because. Um, we only took one shield and Zori has nine health. This is uh, hard. Yeah. And uh, also when you when you take a look at um You could do a yeah. You could do a uh, I don't want to speak too too loud. But... <laughs> um, well bank maneuvers all are are always an option, but I think yes. if you do a hard maneuver uh to the right uh -huh. um you might still have a shot at Ray, possibly Zori, but you need to repair that hull bridge. You yeah. don't want crits. Uh, but at this moment, he has damaged the engine, so that dash will not will not do hard turns. Oh, it's stressed as well. Dash dash is not doing hard hard turns because he has damaged the engine. So only banks. Um, and preferably a blue bank. Yeah. Which I think he has. Only ones are blue. Yes. So one bank to the right, probably because you don't want to go on that obstacle again. Um, Jake is doing everything he can to support Dash. Uh, probably giving him double tokens again. Or he cannot because Dash is stressed. <laughs> He cannot perform actions. No. So this is a talent roll. Yeah, at this point you have to take every shot you can. <laughs> um, well, wounded pilot, I don't care. Uh, damaged engine, I don't care, Luke says. Um, okay, so this is a two straight. So do, does he... Does he rotate? He barrel no, barrel behind the... Okay, behind okay so the well, that's, that's what you want with dash, that's, that's for sure, but... Um, Trying to get an well, obstructed shot here. Yeah, if... Um, if Zori goes hard to her right... That's a good thing for Dash. If she went for a bank maneuver, I think that's um, it will be very hard for Dash to yeah to go to get away and uh, defend. But let's see. Um, she doesn't have bullseye. She still can bear a roll, but she doesn't have a bullseye on Dash. And she um, doesn't. Uh, and Dash does not have uh, arc on. Uh, sorry. Yeah. Uh, well, you just might take uh, range, probably one obstructed shot, and m might be enough. But Ray is also, also needs to move, so... And Jake is a threat here, because Jake is looking at the back of Zori, and he's like, 
Okay, so this is a target lock and look. Um, okay. Maybe Zori wants to finish off Luke. Protons will probably do it, so... Um, Ray is coming in. And I don't think Dash has Arc on Ray as well. No. Um, and now Ray can... Probably take a target lock or a focus and... yeah. Uh, yeah, that's probably protons, but Luke shoots first, so that's at least a good thing. Oh, yes. spend one for okay, he'll, he'll spend it and get it back immediately. Yeah, so that's one way. Um, Dash probably doesn't have any shots. Yeah, he's no. completely out. Um, and now. The resistance girls will do some damage. Um, so Zori or Ray, we'll, we'll see who shoots Ooh. first. Okay. Uh, yeah, that's that look. <laughs> he just confirmed it. Um, yeah, that's that look. That's a lot of crits. Yeah, but we, we, sh we should. We, we should count. I don't know if he could count how many crits were rolled in this match. Yeah. This was like this was this was the critical lore by far. <laughs> um, I think every shot, uh, every every uh, shot that Pavel took had at least one crit in it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> See, we got that a shot true. from Ray. Yeah, Spence that would be three. Force. Yeah. Because Ray is unstoppable. <laughs> yeah. And, that's, and uh, uh, that's two. And Dash has, 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 has gets another crit. So. And it's another crit. Crit. Okay, so it's uh, one that's uh, game. Jake's barrel that could, I think. Oh, no, even. that's uh, Jake is still. <laughs> yeah, that's one Jake Farrell that could. Uh, the hero of the rebellion. Uh, well, I think he. But I yeah. think that is game. Yeah, he. <laughs> He cannot take those two on his own, that's for sure, because Ray is... Yeah. <laughs> well... Um, an interesting you. game. Yeah. Thank you so much, uh, uh, Philip. Uh, let's see You're if welcome. we can get Thank you for Pavel, having me. Uh, Pavel to come around there and... just... see if he's got something to say. About the game. Okay, hello. Congratulations, Pablo. Thank you very much. How does it feel? <laughs> oh, geez. It is exactly one year when I started playing X Wing and it is the first success. So it is uh, amazing, actually. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's uh, that's uh, that's uh, some really good improvement <laughs> in uh, one year. Well, yeah, especially if you play with some noble enemies. Yeah. <laughs> in this case, they are the best, so it means a lot for me. Yeah. No, congratulations and uh, good luck in the future. Thank you. Can I greet my father? He of watches course. this. <laughs> hey, father, cześć tato. Uh, I greet you. Serdecznie pozdrawiam cię. I jak zwykle tam wiesz co i kogo. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, congratulations, Pavel, and well played, Richard. And uh, Philip, thank you so much for hanging out with me tonight. Yeah, thank you for having me. Uh, it was a blast uh, with all of those crits. <laughs> um, we'll have, yeah, we'll have to rewatch the the game and uh, count those crits. <laughs> that that's definitely uh, a good plan. Uh, yeah, uh, I, I'm quite happy that uh, I was able to 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 um, help you with this. Uh, we had two really great games. Um, yeah, well, I, I think I think the 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 conclusion uh, is whatever you put on Ray, she's great, <laughs> and just give Zori some bullseyes, you'll, you'll, you'll get some you'll, you'll, you'll get some good crits. Yeah. Um, <laughs> and bad Poe is still the bad Poe. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> uh, but yeah, a uh, great line for both of them. Yeah, they tried their best. Uh, Rickard played great uh, both of these matches. I, I, I saw uh, that he played, he played great, so uh, yeah. And it's probably fatigue because seven games in a day, that's rough. <laughs> it is. Well, we got to make it an early night here. And uh, thank you so much again, Philip. And thank you, everyone who's been watching. You are the best. Uh, let's see. Have we got any yeah, thank you, all players who's been here, been playing today. Thank you, Kulturvlager in Gothenburg, which uh, is the best venue you can wish for. And uh, I hope to see you soon. Yep, and may the force be with you. Yeah, <laughs> may the force be with you. Good night.